it's really important that you, you put art above all other things, like, or be able to do that, you know? A lot of people can't do that. They can't just, like, put relationships and jobs and shit on hold, you know? Like, whatever it takes. You gotta not, you gotta be real to be a real artist, I think. Like, serious with what you're trying to do. Pretty much all the shit I do in my spare time is creative. Like, same as when I'm working, so. It's like a 24 hour, like, work cycle of creative shit. I can't stop. <laughs> and that's why it's not a secret. It's, I mean, it's not, it's not something I can't explain, you know? It's me behind the wheel or whatever, you know? Drunk. <laughs> <laughs> My name is Technodrome One. Um, comes from uh, the cartoon Ninja Turtles. It's like the vehicle that the bad motherfuckers rolled around in. Yeah, I was born in Dirty Jersey, and um, that shit got old, so I came to New York City. <laughs> that shit got old quick. Art, creativity around in my family. My dad was a painter and an architect, and. Uh, my brother's a writer, and uh, we have a little sister, and she has yet to show her mutant power. <laughs> I went to uh, Pratt Institute in Brooklyn for a little bit for illustration, and then I transferred to the School of Visual Arts in uh, Manhattan for cartooning, comic books and shit. Yeah, I don't, I don't really use the major that I graduated with. I got a bachelor's in cartooning, and, uh, I just do whatever I do now. Technodrome. <laughs> mm. I think my work is successful up to this point because uh, it's very relatable. Um, it's very nostalgic. And it's just like things that I really like and uh, a big variety of things that I think everybody can find something they like in. I think my artwork represents parts of my personality, parts of my history, parts of like my youth, I guess. Like I said, there's a lot of nostalgic shit in my art. Uh, I think my audience takes away like feelings from my artwork. That's why a lot of people like it, I think. Like it, it brings up a lot of old shit in people, like or new shit or pivotal shit, like moments in movies or stories or cartoons like it just stirs up a lot of different feelings i think my first show is the best moment i had in a while like in general you know like everything came together and a lot of people came out and that's like what i just want to keep doing you know that feeling pieces for the new show i think i think it's like the same as the, the shit i've been doing like it's it's things that People that I think are like the best at what they do and stand out and make the, they really make their own art. Like I just draw them because I like them, but it's how they look and their energy that makes people like it, I think. And all the pieces in the show are just like the most powerful pieces. I think some of the things that brought me to this stage in art are uh, just like constantly trying to to change what I'm doing, constantly try to do something I haven't done before. And like that just makes me like go through phases of different styles and it's always fun. I think like always trying to make it fun is like what gets you to progress as an artist. The whole process has just been a way to make more efficient, um, easily like changeable art. That's like I think what really got me to this point. Some of my favorite artists, people that influence me a lot or have, are Egon Schiel, Gustav Klimt, uh, Basquiat, Mr. Brainwash, um, Shepard Fairey, uh, Picasso, any of the masters, like anybody who was like, you know their name. To create like great things, I think you have to like have gone through some shit or like see. The world like really like in a real way you know like whether it's like a loss in the family or like your girl wilding on you 
something happened you didn't want to happen. Whatever you're good at, that like you're expressing yourself in. Like there has to be some kind of like raw ass energy feeling that, you know? I think women inspire me a lot. Like the female figure, um, fashion, for sure. Music is a big thing that inspires me. Like creative shit, like skateboarding. I skate a lot. Like that's a big part of my life. And um, you know, just having fun and shit. Like anything positive. It's Technodrome one in that ass. 